Hey guys, I'm back. So, you know what, whenever I film on my phone, I'm always not sure if I'm centered, because you've got like clear space on this side, and then buttons and controls on this side, and I just, I never, I, I, it bugs me. It's convenient, but you got somebody with PTSD and ADHD and, and anxiety issues, and these, this little, that becomes a big deal in your head when you're trying to focus on stuff. There's your mental health lesson for today. Anyway, um, so I'm going to assume I'm centered. So we need to make some choices about the upcoming subscription boxes we all, all of us, are going to are going to see and unbox in the coming year. About 98% of the unboxings you see on this channel are all bought and paid for, not sponsored stuff. There are times where companies will send me things, and I always tell you when they are sent by a company. But I prefer to actually pay for things so that, again, we can stay honest and brutally honest when necessary. There are some great subscribers uh, and supporters of the channel who also will and have supported the channel by paying for subscri some subscription boxes or even an item here and there and having it sent here so that we can unbox it and we can all look at it. With 2024 coming, we are losing some of the boxes. We're keeping some of the ones that everybody seems to really like. Um, I've done a hundred boxes of Battle Box. We're gonna we're gonna stop doing them now. Battle Box is historically like I've been doing them almost since box number one, box number six. Um, and you know what? Mixed reviews, uh, whatever. We're gonna move on from that. Um, Jason, who has been supporting this channel for years, he's a great guy, um, and he asked me some military questions offline and everything like that. That's awesome. He has provided us with Smoky Mountain Knife Works back when they were doing that, their, their uh, Army Club box, um, Gear Pack, and another one, um, Survival Box. But he's ready to move on from Gear Pack. He's just not thrilled with it. Adam, who has been awesome, he is an awesome guy. We, we communicate offline a lot, too. This is what's cool. I get to meet people also and, like, you know, make friends. Um, he provided a lot of uh, Survival Box, not Survival Box, Crate Clubs. Um, but he's ready to offering to move on from that and, and fund a different box for us to look at. And uh, Kevin, of course, provides TAC Pack. Um, Steve used to pay for Battle Box in the interim. I paid for Battle Box for years and years. Then when I was ready to give it up, Steve said he'll pay. Then I picked it back up somewhere around Mission 100, I think, and, and bought the last. So anyway, it's not just money out of my pocket. It's, it's dedicated supporters of the channel. However... We are making content. I am making content, not just for what we want to see, but for what all of you want to see, all of you out there. So all of you get a vote, get a hand in picking what we get to see next. And by the way, a lot of these boxes that these guys send, I don't just end up with. Sometimes they're like, yeah, you can keep the box. Sometimes they're like, yeah, keep an item or two. But usually if they pay for the box, I got to send it back to them. So uh, just so you know how the whole thing works. Most, any, anything that I pay for, I, I keep because it's mine. And that's where giveaways and, and stuff like that comes from. So I've selected 12 options. These are not the only options we have to look at. If, if you guys out there, subscribers or casual watchers, and if you're not a subscriber, why not? It's so easy and it really makes a difference to the channel. Just go click and then turn on all your notifications because that helps you. Thank you. But even a casual watcher who maybe is new to the channel or has been gone for a while and comes back, you guys are just as important. You can make a choice too. I've selected 12 that I'm going to show you right here today, give you a little explanation on. Um, 11 choices. One is definite. The first one is definite. We're doing it. We're doing it because everybody always likes it. But then 11 options. If there's a box that I don't mention that you think would be great, that people would like to see, that you would like to see on the channel, you feel free to throw that in the comments and drop a link to it. Or if you don't have a link, you know, you just tell us what it is and we'll take a look. What I really want you guys to do is to, in your comments, mention the ones you'd like to see. You can say, I like all 11, do them all. That's not realistic, it's not gonna happen. Um, but I wanna know from you guys what you wanna see. So tell me, Maybe your top three or four that you'd like to see me go forward with on the channel. And then we'll work out and getting those started. Okay, besides the one that we're definitely going to do that I, that I know we're going to do. Always when I'm out here, it's because it's winter and the heater goes on. The HVAC unit outside in the back. So this is really important, guys. It's, it's for you. It's for all of you to decide what you want to see us look at in the future 
of the channel in order to, to suggest more stuff. So take a look, see what's out there, and then let me know. Starting off, we're going to go back to the Shit Hits the Fan Box. Everybody always loves this. It's always a lot of fun. We know we're not going to find great stuff in it, but we're going to have so much fun unboxing it. Maybe finding a gem, maybe not, but definitely making fun of a lot that comes in it. You may not know this, but whether you're looking at Bud K, it's all the same stuff right here, or C.H. Cadellis, Cadellis, whatever, it's all the same. They have all the same stuff. They're basically the same company. So no matter which one we order, it's all the same. It says here, Notify me when it's in stock, but right here it'll let me add it to the cart. Same thing with Bud K. Notify me, but it'll let me add it to the cart. Don't worry, we're going to get this one. I promise we're going to do this because everybody loves it, like I said. So we kind of know what we're in for with this one. No big surprise. This one is a definite. Okay, so let's start with Apocabox. Apocabox is pretty popular. It's owned, curated, and run by Creek Stewart, which is a pretty good name in terms of all this stuff. There's a lot of different plans, but basically we're looking at a bi-monthly box, so we wouldn't get it every month. We can get the regular box, different levels, or we can get just the skills projects. But what's really cool is that instead of just getting a lot of tools and, and items and stuff, they, they give you actual projects, actual skills to learn which we could do together in videos. We could go through them. They would be longer because we'd actually go through these skills and learn how to use these things. But rather than some boxes that just hand you a bunch of stuff, they teach you how to do things as well. So a pocket box is going to be one of our first options we could look at. And as we go through these, remember, you guys don't have to just kind of vote for one thing you want to see. You can kind of come up with a list. You can prioritize it in order from like first choice to last choice. But First one that I'm looking at adding to the channel here is a pocket box. This is one I haven't heard of, and I don't know anybody who has subscribed to this one, but in searching, it looked interesting. You can see on their website, they have a lot of stuff for sale, a lot of products. I'm assuming some of that comes in the boxes too. Um, you know, they really love this backpack, by the way. But as I'm searching, uh, I love this US-based Proud small business, so that's cool. Like most subscription boxes, they have different levels that we can uh, take a look at and subscribe to. So these are the different things. They've got a basic box for about 40, then advanced box for like 65, and the elite box for 109. You can see here they'd say, you know, the average value is going on there. I'm tempted to say if we do do this one, maybe we go big, you know, we, we do that elite box. Because, you know, we probably want to see the most we can. Well, here we have the T word. You know how I feel about the overuse of tactical. But look what's in a tactical box. I doubt we get all that stuff all the time. So, you know, standard website here. Some brands they work with. Um, I don't know. This one was recommended by Crate Joy as I was looking stuff up. So... They've got a bunch of different boxes. They've got a standard, a pro, an ultimate, and then a quarterly. Again, I'm thinking we want to do monthly, so we might do the ultimate one. It's a bit expensive, but, you know, we could at least see what they've got to offer there. Um, but this might be something that looks interesting. They, of course, have all this stuff. Now, I got a little worried when I looked at their products because look at the name. It's the Evatac. And if you remember, I did the video on the, I, I did a whole video that said I bought a knife from an ad on one of my videos and it was the Evatac Rescue Knife and it was just absolutely awful. And here it is, they're selling the Evatac Rescue Knife right here on their website. So this doesn't give me a real warm, fuzzy feeling. So those of you who enjoy when I really hate what's in an unboxing, you might want to pick this one. You might want to vote for it. I don't know. But I am willing to give this one a try if you guys like it and um, kind of want to see what they have to offer. I don't know. Like some of the stuff, you can see that little that little light puck. We got that in Battle Box, and I think we got it in a Barrel and Blade. And I liked it. So at least there's some stuff on there that, you know, we know is kind of decent going into it. 
just looking around at their website. I looked at info and I saw this influencer free box thing, um, which I don't know. You guys know how I feel about that. I looked over all of this little stuff and then, you know, you click the apply now. I just clicked it to see and, and it's just it takes you to the contact page where you can you can just fill out a little thing. We're not doing that. If we're going to get the box, we're going to buy it. This one might be a lot of fun, guys. I don't know if you're into geocaching, how many out there, uh, you know, if me and the boys, we like it. We like it a lot. Geocaching is a whole thing where you uh, you get coordinates or GPS stuff and you go out and you actually find a treasure, you know, like it, it's it's a whole thing. And this is a box specifically geared towards geocaching, which means not only can we unbox the box, but then we can do videos outside where we go and we find the things. And uh, I encourage you to look up geocaching. It's very nerdy. Of course it is. But it is a lot of fun. And me and the boys enjoy doing it. And I think a lot of you guys might like it too if you haven't tried it already. So I've been interested in trying this out for a little while. Uh, this is from a company called Cash Advance. You know, get it? So over here, they're going to tell us um, a little bit about it. What's in the box? You can kind of read along here. If it doesn't make sense to you right now, that's okay. Because if you haven't done geocaching, this probably doesn't make sense. But if we get the box, we'll go through it all and we'll explain it. And it will be it will be cool, you know. Um, so this is one that I am kind of excited about. But again, this is, you know, this is for all of us, not just me. This is for everybody on the channel that watches stuff. Various subscription options, but what's really cool is they tell you they ship to US, Canada, and overseas. And that's cool because with a lot of boxes, our overseas viewers don't get the option. This woman really scares me. There's something in that box that's way too much. I brought this one up because I think there might be interest out there among the crowd. You guys know I'm not I'm not a big hunter, but maybe you guys want to see this one. Um, this is not a big box. And we'll take a look at what's in it. Basically, you get a t-shirt and then an item. However, it's not a very expensive box, so we could easily add this on with some other things that we're doing. And then those of you that are much smarter on the topic of hunting than me can can kind of chime in and tell us what you think of the various things that come in the box. It's only $23 a month, and, you know, that's basically it. And there's not a whole lot more information about it. That It just it is what it is. You get your t-shirt, and you get your one item. Way back when, I got Nomadic. I thought it was very foo-foo, very hipster, but... I have heard that they're doing a lot better lately, so maybe we'll give it a try if you guys want. Now, there's a little little confusion here. Um, I looked it up, and I didn't realize at first, this is just the quarterly. You have to search for Nomadic Monthly if you want to find that one. So this is the quarterly, which means we'd only get it every three months. It's a lot more expensive, but you know, maybe we'll get a, a much bigger thing. I don't know. I stumbled around here looking for the monthly box, and then I took this little this little gear quiz just to see what would happen. And so we're gonna walk through it here, and I just answered some stuff as I was going. Um, so for the quarterly, you get to pick these different topics, right? Uh, I don't know, I was just picking stuff. Now, of course, now they want your email, and if you put your email, they're gonna want your phone number. And to me, that is not worth a 10% discount or anything like that, so. Um, I just said the hell with it. Like I said, I've heard that they've gotten a little bit better. The items have gotten a little more actual outdoorsy stuff. And here's, they give you a little selection. And again, I'm sure this isn't everything that comes in every box. I just realized as I'm watching this, it repeats over and over. Um, but, you know, so the quarterly has these themes. Let's take a look at the monthly now. So with the monthly, there was just there's just one box. There's no levels. Um, you just get the monthly, and you can you know choose to go month to month or prepay, or of course go with the quarterly. Okay, so we already looked at that. Um, 
when you sign up, you get to choose a welcome box. And that, of course, is a, a previous box. They have all these different these different ones. Um, as I was going through here, so when you select one, you get to see what it is. Um, some of them don't come up. I don't know if that means they're not available or there's just not a picture. So it's sometimes the same picture comes up. I don't know. I don't know. But looking at some of the items in these boxes, they're not as hipster foo-foo as the older nomadic ones were. And as we, we go through some of these welcome boxes, seeing what's in them, I don't know. It does look like they're a little bit better than they used to be. Um, so this is definitely one that we can try out. Uh, remember, we're replacing Battle Box. We're replacing Gear Pack. Um, Battle Box was almost $200 a month. So with the money I was spending on Battle Box, we can get shit hits the fan and we can get one or two other things, you know, depending on what it is. And then we also have the backing of some of the other Patreon guys, um, some of the other really long-standing supporters of the channel who, you know, I've been in touch with. They're willing to um, provide other boxes for us. So, you know, we, we have the options to get some really cool stuff thanks to some really awesome people. This is just one of the options we have. And like I said, it does look like maybe they're improving a little bit. So we can consider Nomadic now. Okay, a little different. We're just going to watch this for a minute. Because this is wonderful. Oh, look at it. How do you not love this? Okay, we've done food on the channel before. Um, I don't know how much interest there's going to be in something like this. I love barbecuing and I love grilling. And yes, those are two totally separate things, barbecue and grilling. We can cover that if we do this box. I just thought that maybe this would be a fun thing to do. And then we could, again, do some cooking videos, do some taste testing. Um, I just love meat. I love putting meat in my mouth. So, yeah, I thought that this would be a, maybe a fun one you guys might want to see. I don't know. So, as we look through this all, um, there's just kind of different ways to go on this. Um, it took me a while to get through this website and really figure out kind of what kinds of different things they offer. Um, yeah, they work with different companies, and we're going to look at some of those companies. I don't recognize all of them. Maybe, maybe you guys do. I don't know. But they look pretty cool. They got some fancy names. I recognize some of them. I don't recognize all of them. But, you know, that's the whole point of it. Again, one of the values in, in subscription boxes that I always say is, is discovering new things. Um, so, you know, various things that they, products that they sell and all that. I don't know what I just opened. Sorry. What can we expect in the box? Barbecue sauces, dry rubs, grill master choice. It all sounds good to me. Tips, recipes, exclusive deals. And then we, you know, we're right back where we started. So how does it work? What can we get? Let's take a look. So, of course, you can go month to month. You can prepay. There's lots of options with this one. Um, you know, and, and the whole thing with this is when you prepay, you save money. And then they show you here how much you... Th this is kind of cool. Not every box does this where they actually show you you pick the prepay option. How much money do you actually save? I kind of like that. So I, I probably wouldn't prepay because I don't want to be locked in. If we don't like it, we'll go month to month on it and then, you know, see how we feel. If we do it again, if we do it, we don't have to do this one. Flexibility here. We can choose how often we want the subscription, which I really like that they give you these kinds of options. I know I'm talking a lot about this particular one, but it has to do with grilling and meat. So we're just going to go with it. OK, but I like that they give you all those kinds of options there. And here's the price. So it is kind of a lot for, you know, accessories for meat. But it also includes I'm trying to highlight it here free free shipping in the U.S. So at least it's a flat rate price. It's and you know exactly what it is you're paying for when you pay. Another food, and it's meat again, and it's called jerky snob. I had to throw this one in there. Uh, I love beef jerky. I love jerky of all kinds, but um, most of the family does too. We make our own jerky uh, fairly often, mostly beef. We do other meats as well, um, but... It's Discover Great Jerky. 
how does that not sound good? But, you know, it looks it looks pretty healthy and stuff like that. And we do, um, you know, finest butcher um, and stuff like that. So it, this wouldn't be out of the realm of stuff that we've already done. So this this might be good. I don't know how often you guys like to see the food stuff. I like food stuff because I like food, which is why I'm kind of fat now. But, you know, this looks like it might be good if, for those of you who like the food type content. So you can get a gift subscription. You can just buy products if you want. Okay, let's check out their video. Oh, hell no, hell no. I don't even know what's going on, but I can't, that, no, that music, no, that's not going to work for me. Sorry, sorry. Um, so let's take a look. So you have subscriptions by the bag, two bags, four bags, or eight bags in a single box. Again, I don't, I don't know, you know, it's probably fancy jerky. I don't know. And then you can also choose, you know, how often you want your stuff. And, um, so that's cool. And then the price is, eh. It's it's a little it's a little expensive um, for some bags of jerky, but you know, it's supposed to be all premium stuff. So I don't know if it's something you guys want to see. We can vote on this. If it's not something you guys are interested in, that's that's fine too. That's fine too. Um, you can get gift subscriptions if you you know you know somebody that likes jerky. Uh, let's see their fine products. Three of them, three fine products. Way to go. Okay, so there's there's Jerky Snob. This one was suggested as something different. I don't know. I, it looks like I just can't help but think it looks like some kind of frat house operation. I, I don't I don't know what it is about it, um, but it is the Man Box. There is also Man Box, not to be confused with the Man Box. I'm not sure what we can really expect from this. Um, however. Let's look at these. This really pisses me off. Because, okay, I like this. I like this right here. That's cool, right? I love this. That's that's great. You know, who do, nice cold beer, right? But they went with the Blue Angels instead of the Thunderbirds. And so they've got one strike against them right there. However, I don't think any of those things will be in the package anyway. Um, so this is made by three brothers doing brotherly stuff. Wanting to put together a box for men. Uh, looking at some of the items here, I'm not, I'm not thrilled. But you are a legend, just by looking at this. So you know we can we can take a look at all this. Um, official man box, badass, all that stuff. Um, they like beer, they like boobs. I like boobs, and they like a good time. I can't argue with any of those three things. Those are all great things. Now, we can't exactly send you an ice-cold brew. Wait. Okay. But so when I read this, here's the thing. They like beer, but they're specifically saying they can't send beer. So they address that. But they also say they like boobs. But it doesn't say they can't send boobs. It just says they can't send the beer. They're specifically addressing the beer. So I'm thinking, by that logic, they should be able to send boobs in the box. I don't know. I, I, I'm just, they, you know, they're specifically saying beer and they cannot send beer. But they're not saying they can't send boobs. So I don't know, whatever. Um, so, you know, they have all this legendary and all this stuff. I feel like this is a box for Barney Stinson. But let's take a look, really. Um, it's only $14 a month, which means we could add this on to whatever else. If it's not good stuff, at least we could maybe have a good laugh and 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 tear it to shreds. Which again, those of you who like watching me, oh, this is great by the way. So this is the subscribe. Yeah, we have to go to Crate Joy by the way to actually subscribe to it. This is their website. It doesn't actually work here, but if you go to the Crate Joy website, you can subscribe to it. Any, anyway, it, it is possible. So this might be something we like to laugh at. At least one or two boxes. Um, and I'm, I'm not going to go through the whole thing here, but yeah, I, I found out that if you go through Crate Joy, you know, you can actually subscribe to the box. So could be a thing. 
You guys let me know if this looks interesting, something we might want to try out and just see what it's about. Okay, I got to jump in here because throughout the videos, which really entertains me, I grew up in a family. I'm one of five brothers and, and a dad, and we are all in our own way nerds and geeks and uh, kind of losers. Yeah, no, but we all, we all, when, when it's rare nowadays, but when the five of us, the six of us, including my dad, get together, we speak to each other in movie, uh, TV, and video game quotes. Um, we just shoot one-liners back and forth all the time. And that's why I'm always just mentioning things in the videos, uh, references to cult, pop culture and, and games and movies and TV shows. And I'm pretty proud that you guys pick up on it. I'd say about 75% of the time. I know some obscure, stupid B-movie crap. But a lot of you guys seem to, to pick up on it too, which makes me, it just, it brings warmth and joy to my heart like puppies and candy canes and puppet shows. So I'm going to introduce two geeky, nerdy things, choices to this mix, just for those of us among us who might want to see them. So keep in mind, that's what these last two are when you look at them. I've seen Loot Crate before. It has just a lot of random stuff. Cool stuff from movies, TV shows, video games, uh, anime stuff. Again, this is for the nerds among us. Um, I know not everybody's going to be into this, but there might be some of you who are who would want to see this stuff. Uh, you know, so uh, like I justified a minute ago, it could be kind of cool. It could be good stuff for giveaways for for the nerdy geeky among us. Um, you know, they I, I, all sorts of random stuff, all sorts of I, I've seen people that have gotten these boxes before. It's not all winter stuff. It, some of it's really cheesy, but some of it's really cool. So this is definitely something we can look into. Um, definitely something I would be interested in. Would you guys be interested in something like this for our nerdy level kind of stuff? Last box we're looking at one of my favorite favorite franchises, favorite IPs, whatever. I, I love Fallout. I've been playing it for years, all different games and everything. This is an every other month box. I don't know. we got Fallout fans out there. This is by the same guys. This is by Loot Crate, but it's a Fallout specific box. I guess I threw this on there because I think it's cool, and I'm hoping some of you will think it's cool too. But I think this could be really awesome if we've got some gamers out there and some true nerdy, geeky guys and gals like me. Um, again, it is every other month, so this is something we could kind of slide in with, with other boxes we're doing if there's an interest out there to see this kind of stuff. And again, probably we, we get some things to throw in some giveaways and, and all that. I know this is a very niche kind of thing. Um, Here's the specific shipping and all that. I don't know how much interest there would be to see this on the channel, but totally willing to do this if there's enough of you that would want to see this. Uh, I don't know. I, I I still play Fallout. I play. I still play 76. I play 4 over and over again, New Vegas, and 3, um, because those are the ones I can play on the Xbox. So um, you guys let me know if this is something that you think would be cool. By the time you see this, you will have seen all the choices. So I hope you're entertained by some of those. Um, I hope you may be excited to see some of them and comment. Yeah, I want to see those. I want you to open those boxes. I want to see what they have to offer on the channel. If not, like I said, I'm, I'm hoping that we'll get some more suggestions that some of you will be like, hey, you didn't see this box out there somewhere. Let's suggest this. And really, we're just going to, you know, I'm going to let this go for a couple weeks. And the majority comments... We'll, we'll tally them up or if there's something that just really catches my eye you know um, we'll do it some of the boxes that we're discontinuing are very expensive boxes so I know that out of my pocket I can pay for two or three of these ones we looked at based on the price of, of Adel box you know um, and I don't want to speak for some of the other guys that normally support the channel but we'll see what they're willing to chip in with also because there's some really great dudes they really are talking to them is really awesome for me um, as a mental health wise just to have somebody some cool folks in my life but 
they're really great guys too. So I, I feel confident they will help out and we'll let them see. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please let us know what you, all of you want to see on the channel going forward so that we can have fun all together. Remember that you guys are all absolutely awesome. I appreciate every single one of you because I make videos, but it's all of you that make up the channel. And I'll be back again real soon.